Y'all, I am about to introduce you guys to Miss Margaret. I was tagged in this video, this one video, and it led me to a soap opera. And Miss Margaret said, love doesn't live here anymore, Otis. Now, I don't know if Otis is her name. I mean, it's um, her ex-husband's name, but we're calling him Otis for the sake of this story. So Miss Margaret and Otis were married and Otis was out here running the streets, doing whatever he wanted to do, cheating and not treating Miss Margaret right. So he gets put out. He gets put out the house and Miss Margaret said she got peace now. And now Otis, he ain't getting the cooking like he was doing uh, with when he was with Miss Margaret. Esther ain't hitting up them same notes because when he was living with Miss Margaret and just cheating, he got the benefits of living with Miss Margaret. And now Miss Esther, who's that's the a name I made up. Now Miss Esther ain't hitting them same notes right. And he's over here texting and calling and trying to come back home and work it out. Now I sat here and watched several of Miss Margaret's videos simply because I'm invested in this story now. But um, so you don't have to. I've posted two of the videos. I'll post her TikTok information if you want to go back and watch the videos. But I was definitely tickled. I was especially tickled when she started talking about the food that she was about to cook that he couldn't have. And t saying that her friend could stop by and get a plate talking about some peach, some warm peach cobbler with some vanilla ice cream. Definitely giving you granny vote, um, granny mode. I started thinking about grannies and my mama, but you know, if you have a granny, if you have a mama, go ahead and give them a call because I definitely started thinking about my grandmothers after watching Miss Margaret. Anyways, y'all jump into these comments. Miss Margaret said, Love don't live here no more, and I want you guys to be as tickled as I was. I'm laying here half asleep watching a movie and it's watching me or whatever the case may be. Texting, 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 texting. We need to talk, Margaret. Answer the phone, Margaret. I need to come home. I'm your husband. We need to work this out. Twelve years then passed. When I wanted to talk, he didn't want to talk. When I wanted to work it out, he didn't want to work it out. I went on and on, pouring my heart out to him, didn't want to listen. The more I tried to come to him and say, hey, this isn't right, we need to do this, we need to do that. Oh, I don't want to talk about that right now. So now, the ball is in my court. Hey, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to see him, I don't want to talk to him. And I sure in hell don't want him to keep texting me. What's fixing to happen, he going to be on the block list because I am moving on. I'm moving on. It's a wrap. It's a done deal. I'm just tired of being tired of this whole drawn out situation of him and me. I just wasted too much time with this. The aggravation, the humiliation, the laughing, the belittling, the talking, the chattering, the sneaking, the creeping, the cheating, the thoughts, the gambling, the late nights, all, all of that balled up into one big explosion, one big earthquake. I just, my mind just can't wrap around all of this no more. It's just one big mess. I, I, I just, I just don't want to, to do it anymore. I don't have the energy. I'm so sick of it. My head hurts. <clears throat> my head hurts from just even thinking about all the stuff I've been doing. Hmm. How do how do you get to this point from loving someone that they're your love of your life, your placeholder, your best friend, 
your ride or die, your rock, and then they turn into a person that you can't stand, you don't want to see, you don't want to hear, you don't want to communicate with them, it's called pill to swallow. When the tables turn, I just don't want to hear nothing he has to say. It's block list time. He's going up on the block list. This man has called me 35 times. This man has sent me more texts than I care to say. Next, he'll be bamming at the door. Lord, have mercy. Help me, Lord. Help me, Lord, in this situation. <laughs> now you want to talk. I guess it ain't working out in the streets. Hmm. It's a horse of a different color when the wife gets rid of you. Maybe she don't want him now. It's okay to play in the streets because she knew he had to come home, or they knew he had to come home. Hmm. The ball is in their court, not mine. Oh, well, let me sit up and try to continue watching my movie. Life goes on. That's not my concern no more. I am done. I can lay around. I can do what I want to do when I want to do it. If I don't want to put clothes on, I don't. I can just do me. Mm. Oh, well, hmm. I'm going to sit here and watch all of this stuff unfold. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Got somebody can do better than me. People waiting to take my place. Okay. We going to see who the new <laughs> Miss G going to be. Because uh, we'll never find another one like me. Mm. On the real. Never. John Bestie. Girl, let me tell you, let me tell you, let me tell you what the 411 is. Oh, girl, well, word on the street is he over there comparing me to her and telling her why she can't do this, why she don't cook, why she don't clean, why she don't do X, Y, and Z. Okay, if that's the case, why are you behind this stay at home? Because when you was at home, he was complaining about uh, this and that. You know, he didn't appreciate the stuff, so to speak. Now he over there throwing me up in her face. Yeah, uh-huh, he fumbled the bag and got took. He got huh, he got what he deserved, okay? I don't feel sorry for him. He can't come back here. I'm doing fine, mighty fine, mighty fine, living in peace over here, doing me. You know what I'm saying? Now, let me tell you this, girl. She is stalking my pages. She's on Facebook trying to befriend me. One of them. I'm talking about one of these women. She's on Instagram in my story. She's over here in my story. She's liking stuff. You know, and it makes me wonder if she does she want to be me. She want to see what do I have that she don't have. See, the tables done turned now. See, I used to wonder what did she have that I didn't have. That's why when I step out this mother scrubbing house, I make sure I'm well put together. I make sure I'm together from the head to the toe. <laughs> to the toes, down to the toenails. Hello. So when I run into her or him, they see that I'm doing fine. I can be hurting on the inside, but shit, they'll never know it. Because guess what? I'm doing me. She wanted to step into my shoes and take my place. Hello, them some big damn shoes. Because I knew without a shadow of a doubt that that was not going to work. So baby, they can miss me with it, bestie. Girl, yeah, he over there telling me, well, you know, Margaret did this. Margaret was a, a good cook and Margaret took the kids and did this with the kids and Margaret this, Margaret that. Oh, baby, my name is just thrown out in the atmosphere all over the place over there. And she is sick and tired of being sick and tired of hearing about me. Hello, I don't care. I blocked him on social media. I blocked him in my phone. And I damn sure been blocking her. But the crazy thing, girl, she gonna make other pages and she's so silly. Then she get on there with the same phrases to let me know that that's her. 
I said, man, oh man, oh man, huh, karma is real. It didn't take long for them to fall out over there, I see. See, it's a horse of a different color when the wife got them and they at home with you than when they actually over there with them. But he got another thing coming if he think I'm going to be the tail end of the person that he chooses me to be and I'm going to flip and be the other woman. Oh, hell to the no. I'm not fit to be in reverse and be the reversible party for him. He wanted her. He need to stay over there with her. With his narcissistic ass behavior. He is a very narcissistic person. I can't do him. Ever, 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 ever again. I got peace. I got peace. Sure, I miss a lot of sleep. I got a lot of lonely nights. I don't have nobody beside me. But guess what? I got peace inside of me. So she better take what she got and roll with it, baby. I don't give her two hoots about him and her. God, yeah, I'm still in the bed, girl, but I want to tell you 411. I'm laughing on the inside out, baby, to heck with those two. Mm. Just creeping on my social media to see what's up with me. Yeah, I got to put another nap in here. Yeah, I put my earplugs in so I can call you. You know, not them plugs, but my eye, my iPhone thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess I could call you and tell you about this that gum. He come over there. No, nah, girl. I'm going to get up and clean my whole house and cook me some country dinner. I'm going to smother me some ribs and gravy. And I think I'm going to make me a little potato salad. Some baked beans, some macaroni and cheese, and a side of homemade hot ass peach cobbler with butter on the top. Hello? With a little vanilla ice cream on top. Hello, 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 somebody. Girl, it feels good to smile. Girl, yes. I'm going to get up and put my clothes on. Yeah, come out. Get your plate. All right. Bye.